guys, Jemmy God here, and today I'm going to be showing you the Jemmy Animated Fart Guy. Now one retailer that sold this guy was obviously Spencer's Gifts, because, uh, as you can see, I got one that came with the traditional, um, box made exclusively for him, but he also had his own, uh, Spencer's Gifts designed box as well, so, uh, besides Spencer's Gifts, I'm guessing one other retailer that may have sold this guy was KB Toys, because, well, uh, I think the Jimmy fan said it best. Um, he did a video um, on a KB Toys store sign he uh, found and uh, took home for himself. And he explained that a vast majority of Jimmy's classic items, air blown inflatables, pop culture series, turtle dancers, and all that jazz, things like that, were all sold at uh, KB Toys. Or at least KB Toys was one retailer that carried a good majority of Jimmy's classics. And uh, like he said, it's a shame that... Uh, that company is no longer around. So, uh, I have to assume that KB Toys was another retailer that sold this guy, but Spencer's was definitely one of them. And as for this guy, I got it back in January, because, uh, I was actually inspired to buy this by Toys & More's reviews, because he's got, like, uh, three versions. Um, one with the traditional box, one with the Spencer's box, and then another version as well that has, a uh, different appearance. And this guy fully works, despite the fact that he's string-controlled, and of course the head's got a micro motor in there. I know it does because there's no way they'd be able to fit a regular motor in there. So I'm surprised that the mouth didn't snap on this guy yet. It probably won't for hopefully a good long while. And I actually do remember seeing um, uh, Mike Mozart, um, the product guru who was the runner of the Jeepers Media YouTube channel. He actually had a video of this guy on his channel. But unfortunately that video has since been lost media. But uh... I think he said that this was made by Jemmy, but he pronounced it Gemmy back in the day. But it's now pronounced Jemmy. And yes, this is in fact a Jemmy item. And, uh, like I said, it's a shame that that video that Mike Mozart did on this guy is pretty much lost media. If anyone somehow still has it archived, um, please re-upload it because I really would like to see that video again for all time's sake. But anyways, here's the box. It says, Fart Guy, Crude Dude, Try Me. Press his button and watch the maestro perform. Here's the side of the box. Fart guy, mouth moves as he speaks. He's the master of the underarm. For ages 6 and up, requires 3 AA batteries. And this guy still had his original Duracell demo batteries installed. And they were working just fine, despite their age. But of course, since I didn't want the, uh... <clears throat> The batteries corroding in the battery compartment. I took them out and replaced them with some actually brand new batteries. So he should be good to go for a long time to come. Fart guy, crude dude. His mom was wrong when she said that this talent would get him nowhere. <laughs> Ain't that the truth. www.jemmy.com. Fart guy. Sold for only $10. What a price, I tell ya. 2005. Jemmy Industries Corporation. Coppell, Texas. Made in China. Other side... Fart guy, mouth moves as he speaks. He's the master of the underarm. And the battery instructions are on the bottom there. So, uh, I'm, even though you guys have pretty much seen this guy in action, I guess I'll show you this guy in action from, uh, one of my videos as well. So here he is in action. Which nobody can deny. 
I am a professional. Do not try this at home. Really funny item that still holds up two decades later. Let's get him out of the box now. And this guy is relatively small, as you uh, probably would have imagined. Um, and this actually is not the only uh, Jemmy item to uh, be standing on a small colored base like this. Um, a couple years after this guy, Jemmy actually made a, an item called the Drinkin' Buddies, which which was basically a uh, a redneck holding a beer bottle. Um, I, I think it came out like two years after this guy, but that one's also a Spencer's exclusive. I uh, don't have one yet, but if I see one or find the time to get one, I'll be sure to. The base looks relatively clean, too. It's got the Fart Guy logo both on the top there and on the front. Fart Guy. Hmm. It's a good thing I didn't have to repair this guy. And it's even more convenient um, with just how easy it should be to access the mechanism. Because you got all the screws back here. All those screw holders just out in the open. <laughs> nice. So if this thing ever breaks, I should be able to gain easy access to the mechanism. And uh, it, it really shouldn't be that hard to repair one of these guys. Because, like, like, this thing is literally entirely string controlled. Both the mouth and the arm and foot are string controlled. But, uh, I'm, but uh, the arm and foot are attached to one motor. So uh, that's actually kind of impressive. That, it's actually kind of impressive that they managed to... Uh, um, combine another two and one with just, uh, one motor. And, and this is just for string controlled mechanisms. Like, gear controlled mechanisms having two and one is, uh, special enough on its own, but string controlled mechanisms that are two and one, that's a whole nother level of just wow. And again, this was from 2005, so very impressive for the time. There's the battery compartment. It reads Jemmy Industries Corp. www.jemmy.com. Made in China. There's the QC Pass. I guess we'll go ahead and go another round with his phrases now. This plus this equals this. Ooh. And yes, I am refined too. I like classical music. <laughs> And there you go, guys. That's the Jemmy Animated Fart Guy. And this guy is relatively common if you're curious to uh, buy one for yourselves. Just go on eBay or Macari or Craigslist or whatever online shopping uh, thrift store you use. Search up Jemmy Fart Guy and chances are you'll probably see one for sale for a relatively good price. So uh, if you're interested in uh, getting one of these, I highly recommend doing that. Because this guy really has a certain charm to him that... Uh, God, you don't really get it with a lot of farting novelty items. Uh, except for Joe Blow. Like, I honestly don't know which is funnier of these two. Fart Guy or Joe Blow? For now, I'm gonna go with Joe Blow, but only by like a hair or so. Thanks for watching!